The static balance of the human body is the ability to maintain a specific posture as still as possible. So-called quiet stance tasks are most often used for the assessment of static balance. The specific characteristics of the body sway are influenced by several factors such as the size of the support area, the height of the center of gravity, age, injury, etc. Body sway is evaluated through measurements of the sway of the center of pressure below the subject's feet. Enter the body sway test module from the main window by clicking on the body sway icon. Make sure you have acquired the subject's body weight beforehand. As with the organization of all the MARS test modules, the interface is divided into left setup panel, right analysis panel, bottom measurement panel, and the central signals and results area. Before starting the measurement, appropriate input parameters must be determined in the setup panel. These are upper extremities, where you can choose among hands positioned on the hips, hands free, across the chest, or behind the neck. Afterwards, select the sensory manipulation, where you can choose among closed eyes, open eyes with no manipulation, or vestibular manipulation. After the sensory manipulation is determined, select the stance position where you can choose among parallel stance, semi-tandem stance, tandem stance, single leg stance on the left leg, or single leg stance on the right leg. Then determine the length of the task in seconds under the duration drop-down menu. For an additional task during measurement, you can choose among without an additional task, additional mental task 297 294 291 288 285 or additional motor task to define the footwear you can choose among barefoot running shoes walking shoes or high heels to start with the measurement, click on the New Measurement button. After launching the test module and clicking the New Measurement button, initialization and offset takes place. During this time, the subject should not be on the force plate. If necessary, the test can be cancelled by pressing the Cancel button. Before starting with the measurements, the subject must assume an appropriate initial position which is determined with the input parameter. The goal of the task is to stand as still as possible. Initiate the measurements by pressing the Start button. If the subject falls or moves, the measurement needs to be repeated. The measurement stops automatically after the predetermined time period. It can also be stopped manually by pressing the Stop button in the lower panel. The measurement can be repeated by clicking on the New Measurement button and not saving the previous repetition. If you are satisfied with the measurement, you can save it. The central window displays the COP measured by the force plate. If the settings for the analysis were changed after the measurement was completed, you can reanalyze the data by clicking on Analyze. The ground reaction force signal can be viewed under the Signals tab. The data of the analysis can be viewed under the Results Table tab. The result parameters are divided into different groups separated by blue headings. A more thorough description of the parameters can be accessed by right-clicking on the parameter name. The options for displaying specific sets of parameters can be assessed in the Parameters View menu in the right panel. For more information on the topic, 
please refer to tutorial number 7.